Hey, hey, real quick, before this video starts, I just wanna jump, this is like present day Tim, we filmed this from before, but I just wanna say hey, what's up, how are you, Appa Kabar, to the 3,000 people who just subscribed. This is crazy, welcome to the channel. We're going somewhere you might be familiar with, that's right, we're going back home to Indonesia, and you're gonna watch that journey today. But stay tuned, there's a lot more amazing Indonesian content coming, just stay subscribed to this channel, and we'll give you what you wanna see. And now back to the video. It's another interesting travel day. Basically now, trying to get back to Indonesia. It's not going well at all. I was originally just supposed to fly from Miami to Newark and then Newark from San Francisco and San Francisco to Singapore and Singapore directly into Bali with a nonstop flight. But now, one of those flights, the one from Newark to San Francisco, got delayed by over three hours. It's completely breaking up that sequence. And they now have me going from Miami to Newark, Newark to Phoenix, Phoenix to San Francisco, San Francisco to Singapore, but with very little time between. So I really hope this whole day is gonna work out. I don't know. Apparently there's some tornadoes or something. This is not the way I thought today would go. Alright, here we go. I guess it's 41 hours starting now in transit. Katrin and I just finished up a short week here in Miami, Florida, visiting my parents, going to my friend Robin's wedding, and seeing many other family and friends. I haven't seen anyone here since long before 2020, and Katrin has never actually met my parents, so this was a very big deal. We wandered through Wynwood and just spent quality time with the family. My mom whipped out the baby photos, and Germany and Jamaica were united once and for all. All right, so I'm presently on a flight to Phoenix of all the places. This is the creative route, the very scenic route to get me all the way to Indonesia, I guess. So let's go to Phoenix, Arizona. I really hope my family can come visit us in Bali, though, very soon, because this trip was way too short. All right, so I'm in Phoenix now, heading still to San Francisco. This is just like an unnecessary stop in order to make my flight on time. I'm literally getting back on the same plane. I'm only here for 20 minutes. I'm gonna keep going to San Francisco. This has been quite the situation. Okay, so that was 38 minutes in Phoenix. I guess I still haven't been here. Onward to San Francisco. A few moments later. Okay, so I'm in. San Francisco now. I just realized I've been traveling for like 13 hours. I'm still in the United States of America. Like, how did that happen? But we're gonna go ahead and jump on the big flight now. We're getting on the flight from San Francisco to Singapore nonstop. It is United Flight 1. I think still their longest flight at 17 hours. So let's just add 17 on top of the 13 we already did. Why not? I'm starting to feel a little bit loopy. I think I'll make it. I've done this flight six times already, but this, this is a very unusual travel day. guest. <laughs> Are you going back to Bali? Or? Yeah, yeah, yeah. How's it going, guys? <laughs> <laughs> All right. All right. I'll see you. Five flights later, I've made it here to the Singapore airport, and wow, I'm pretty beat. This is not my normal situation. Normally do this much more efficiently. The good news is, Singapore Airlines, I went to the transit desk and they were able to transit my baggage, so I don't actually have to clear immigration. I don't actually have to enter Singapore. I can stay right here in the lovely Changi Airport terminal and just walk to the next gate. So that was really easy and really good. And actually too, they were also able to move me from the evening flight departing at 4 p.m. to a flight that's leaving in about 52 minutes. So actually, 
we gotta run. But yeah, by lunchtime, we should be eating nasi goreng. I'm really excited. Speaking of the Singapore airport, it is insanely busy. This is as busy, if not busier, than I ever remember it being. All the stores are open, everything seems pretty normal. Everybody is, of course, wearing masks, but it is very, very full in here. There are flights going all over the world, coming in, coming out, as Singapore has just reopened their borders on the first. I'm gonna go now in Terminal 1, and I don't have time to really do anything. It's a really efficient transit because they were able to switch me, but I'm happy to be instead just going straight to Bali earlier. Okay, I guess after nine months, nine very long months, coming back to Indonesia. Very excited. I'm gonna be there in time for lunch. throw this plane like literally it's like the galley is here my seat is right there couldn't be more excited to get back to Indonesia after five flights let's do this I really can't believe that I'm finally on a flight to Bali it started to feel a bit hopeless after so many different delays and nine months away from a place that I've started to consider home I'm so excited to get back to Indonesia get back to all of you and start traveling and showing you the coolest things to do here in probably the best place in the entire world Ladies and gentlemen, please take care when opening the other compartments and remember to take all your belongings with you. It's been our pleasure sending you on this flight. Thank you for flying Singapore Airlines, a member of Star Alliance. Bali is 100% fully open and well on its way to a tourism recovery. It keeps getting easier and easier to enter Indonesia, so everything changes almost every single day. Here on the screen at the publishing time of this video are the latest requirements that you need. So as you can see, you need a lot less than I needed when I entered. Unfortunately though, as the number of flights increase, so does the volume of people in this maze of document checking. It's probably a one and a half to two and a half hour long process depending upon what what time you arrive and how many flights are arriving at the time that yours arrives. Thankfully, if you want, we can hook you up with a VIP service that will whisk you past this whole mess and then transfer you directly to your hotel or villa. Feel free to DM us with the link below for more info on that. But it's still an amazing time to explore this beautiful island. All right, back to Indonesia. And of course, if you're coming here, you have to take a PCR test. My body's so dry. This is gonna be very hard. Okay, I will deserve in your nose and mouth, okay? Oh, nose and mouth, oh boy, yeah. serious. Okay, I will deserve in your nose parts, okay? Okay. And the top, please. Okay. Okay, relax. Relax. Open your mouth, Okay, finish. That's it? Yeah, well done. Oh, Thanks, go to immigration. Okay, thank, thank you. you. Okay, sure, sure. Yeah. Okay, makasih. <laughs> Finally. Hello. Welcome back to Bali then. Oh my gosh, you lost weight. You look good, man. You look good. <laughs> I have no bags. Yeah. <laughs> If you want to see more videos of our travels and adventures all around, please be sure to subscribe to this channel and we'll catch you in the next video.